Have the presidential debates helped educate the voters on the basic issues? Do the people know the fundamental disagreement between Kennedy and Nixon? In the second debate, Senator Kennedy said, I believe that our power and prestige in the last eight years has declined. Now, what is the issue is what we're going to do in the future. Now, that's an issue between Mr. Nixon and myself. He feels that we're moving ahead uh, in a, we're not going into a recession in this country economically. He feels that our power and prestige is stronger than it ever was relative to that of the communists, that we're moving ahead. I disagree. And I believe the American people have to make the choice on November 8th between the view of whether we have to move ahead fast, whether what we're doing now is not satisfactory, whether we have to build greater strength at home and abroad. And Mr. Nixon's view, that's the great issue. President Eisenhower moves from the scene on January 20th and the next four years are the critical years. And that's the debate. That's the argument between Mr. Nixon and myself. And on that issue, the American people have to make their judgment. And I think it's an important judgment. Senator Kennedy discussed the issue on Meet the Press Sunday, October 16th. When I use the word prestige, I'm talking about the image of the United States abroad, militarily, economically, politically, socially, scientifically, educationally. I believe in all those areas, our relative position is not satisfactory. We have sufficient momentum because we had an, an atomic monopoly for a while and a hydrogen monopoly, and we had our great airlift capacity. We, had a great, we have sufficient uh, momentum to carry us through to the present time as a strong military power. But the rate of increase, the rate of military growth is not in our favor. That's what I disagree with. In fact, we've been living off our fat for the last three or four years militarily. The Soviet Union made the great breakthrough in space and in missiles. And therefore, they are going to be ahead of us in those very decisive weapons of war in the early 60s. What is true in militarily is true economically. Their rate of increase is greater. It's certainly true scientifically. And in the image they give to the world of a country on, on the move.